Hey guys, welcome to the Simplify Your Life podcast. It's Coach Simona and I'm glad you decided to tune in. What's up guys? In today's podcast episode, we're going to continue with the third installment of Project Femininity, my series on how to become more feminine. If you haven't listened to the previous episodes, I will link them below. Today, ladies, we are going to explore why we, as women, prioritize everything else and everyone else above our self-care. And I will share with you three techniques that you can implement into your daily routine to feel more relaxed and at ease in life. Let's begin. My first tip is to dedicate one hour per day of guilt-free pleasure time. If you're anything like me, you're probably spending a good chunk of your time thinking about work, doing the actual work, or stressing out about your loved ones. At the end of the day, you're so exhausted, you can barely remember your own name and fall asleep before you can catch your breath. Then the cycle repeats itself until you feel unsatisfied with your life and you know it's time to make a change, but you're not sure what to do exactly. That's where the guilt-free pleasure time comes in. I want you to stop making excuses for prioritizing other people and other things and not finding the time just to enjoy yourself. Think about it. Is life all about work or relationships? Isn't it about having fun, being content with yourself and living it without any regrets? I can already hear some of you saying, but Simona, you don't understand. I'm a mom, or I'm a CEO, or I'm a housewife. I don't have time for this. I know, it's hard to put yourself first. In fact, I think it's one of the hardest things to do, especially for people pleasers. But you've got to protect yourself and recharge those batteries if you want to be a feminine woman. Femininity is about having fun, being light, happy, and finding joy in the little things in life. If you're constantly overwhelmed with responsibilities, when will you have the time to have a little fun? If one hour seems unrealistic during the week, you can take 30 minutes per day doing something that brings you absolute joy. And then dedicate at least one hour during the weekend. What could you spend this hour on? Well, it's all up to you. What's important here is to give yourself that time to experience life without thinking about your endless to-do lists. Here are some examples of guilt-free things that you can do. Lay on the couch and watch a romantic movie. Make yourself a spa night. Light up some candles and take a bath. Paint your nails while listening to uplifting music. Take yourself out on a date at a nice restaurant. Compose a song, etc. Do what feels right for you. Do something that gets you into the flow. Be creative, fun, and light. Knowing how to enjoy life is one of the best qualities of a feminine woman. So make sure to schedule that guilt-free hour for yourself every single day. My second tip is to relax your muscles. There's a wonderful technique that I'm about to teach you. And I'm not kidding you. It may turn out to be life-changing. Today we're not going to focus on meditation, mindfulness or yoga. We all know these are wonderful techniques and I have already made separate episodes on them. Now, what is this mysterious technique that I'm talking about? It's called progressive muscle relaxation. I want to make a quick disclaimer. If you have clinical anxiety or some medical condition that needs the guidance of a professional, please skip this exercise or do it at your own risk. I'm going to give you a brief description of the exercise and you can pause the audio to try it out for yourself and come back to finish the episode later. Here's what you're going to need. 15 minutes, a quiet place where you won't be disturbed and somewhere comfortable to lie down, your bed, a yoga mat, etc. If you're wearing any shoes, please remove them. The first thing you're going to do once you lie down is close your eyes and take 5 deep breaths Breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. First, you're going to apply muscle tension to a specific part of your body. For example, your legs. You're going to squeeze the muscles as hard as you can. And then exhale as you let go of your muscles and relax. 
Let's begin by targeting different muscle groups in your body, starting with your toes, then your entire legs, then we will continue with your buttocks, stomach, chest, hands, then entire arms, neck, shoulders, and finally your face. Take short breaks of 15 seconds between each muscle group. Once you're done with the whole body, relax for 15 seconds and then squeeze all of your muscles at once. Then release and feel the energy flowing through your body. Let your breathing slowly get back to normal. Pause this audio and come back when you're done. The purpose of this exercise is to not only release the tension of your muscles, but to also help you become more at ease and aware of your bodily sensations. Being a feminine woman is all about being aligned with your body. If you're constantly in your head, that means that you're letting your masculine energy dominate. I recommend you do this exercise once per week so it doesn't become too overwhelming. Now let's get to my final tip. Practice doing nothing for 10 minutes every day. The practice nothing technique forces you to sit with your thoughts and feelings and endure them for 10 minutes. Why is that so helpful? And how is it related to relaxation and becoming more feminine? Every feminine woman needs to learn how to let go and allow everything to just effortlessly unfold. This is one of the hallmarks of the flow state, and that's exactly what doing nothing helps with. It's essentially all about sitting down for 10 minutes, away from distractions, responsibilities, and temptations. Just you and you alone. If you practice it regularly, it will help you get into the flow state quickly and easily, which will make you more relaxed and in touch with your femininity. So to recap, dedicate one hour guilt-free pleasure time. Set 15 minutes every week to relax your muscles and try to do nothing for 10 minutes every single day and then watch your life change before your eyes. Thank you so much for listening to this episode. If you liked it, please like it. And subscribe to my channel if you don't want to miss out on my weekly episodes. Let me know in the comments below which one of these techniques are we going to try. And I will talk to you in the next one. I love you guys. Bye.